shopping i was just looking and browsing through i just seen that okay they now have like spring summer 2024 collections out across different brands you know so even the wrong way they're already doing it probably they started doing it from last year now guys uh this brings us to today's video so when i went to Shein, um they already have their spring summer 2024 collections so i decided to pick quite a bit of bits now not a few quite a lot so we got a lot to go through and we're not going to sit in one video so i'm gonna this video is going to be in three parts because I got PJs to go through and I got these dresses as well to go through. Now guys, uh, welcome to my channel. I am your host Elodie. How are you guys doing today? I hope everybody's keeping fabulous. Now guys, we're going to try something. So I got these pieces that they are cheap pieces, they're inexpensive, they're really inexpensive pieces. So we're going to try them as a whole. We're going to try and elevate the style a little bit because I feel like Things like this is something I just went to the grocery store, you know, just around, like with slippers. But we're going to try. We all know because the type of material, guys. But we're going to try and elevate it to give it some a touch of elegance and a touch of class. Now, um, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, guys, hit the subscribe button. Get a notification bell also that's when I have new content, guys. You will not miss out. The content are going to be coming in like this. So, guys, listen keep that notification bell on now ladies there's gonna be another video pj so is it worth buying pajamas like pjs sleeping shorts and tops trousers and tops from Shein? i don't know i don't know but <laughs> just watch out for that video because that's gonna be a video coming so guys we can all sit down together get a cup of tea let's talk now ladies um without further ado let us jump into this video so the very first piece i have here is what you see here it is i'm not gonna lie sexy like you know i'm not somebody that likes to put her cups on display because you can't hide it you know so i don't really like wearing fitted clothes because <laughs> if i go anywhere like this everyone's gonna stand and stare so i always try to keep my clothes not very close to my body now look at what i'm wearing this skirt is a two-piece it's a two-piece you guys it's a two-piece and it has a top but it is really nice it doesn't come with this top the top is different i think the top is from sheen sexy i don't know what the brand okay guys it's cheaper i think the worst quality ever is the ones that are from sheen like a regular sheen when it's a shin with a name like shin noir shin x shin sexy the, the quality is a little bit higher now ladies look at this one here the top is gorgeous you know and yeah it does put a little bit of my jubbly bits out there but it's not something that um i can complain about i'm just gonna try to elevate this outfit so you guys so what i've just done is i left my sleeves down if you're a fashionista you should know how to rock and roll your clothes like slay your clothes so i've left the sleeve down but i pulled the blazer like to my elbow it has given it a jump like a touch of elegance yes this is what we're talking so you're lifting something inexpensive to look elegant and classy there you go ladies there you go paired with this beautiful bag one of my tried and true from sheen there you go very simple just a very pretty simple look like you have to know ladies you have to know how to accessorize and how to jump your clothes again goes back to when you're shopping always make sure you look at your wardrobe the palette and see like when you get pieces there are things that you can tie together this my blazer is from asos from the men's department so now i'm loving this outfit loving the skirt on the top and the blazer the whole assemble guys love it this outfit is this one here i have put on the light because i think it's getting really dark now this is a two-piece um the skirt the top came with a skirt so i'm going to turn so that you can see what it looks like guys like it's got a very long sleeve at the back but i feel like it's really it's a gorgeous skirt and top but this is just something that you can 
run around with like grocery store i'm going to the beach you know that sort of with slippers you know not sandals like just the pot you know some just slippers look sort of look I, I mean that's what i feel this sort of outfit but you can tone things up what you have to do add a blazer a bag and some pumps and it will change the whole so outfit guys, what i have just done is i've added a blazer i've added some bags and my pump by doing this my outfit has just gone from running around day look to a night look look at that ladies isn't that gorgeous you're just going from what well, is a cheap outfit to an elegant outfit so here i really love the fact that this is ankle length and guy it gives it a touch of class and a touch of elegance so that's how you can get a cheap outfit into something looking very elegant next one is this one i guess you guys saw it hanging there so it's another two piece you guys look at that um i don't really like this color it's gray i didn't know what it was gonna look like when it came also it's pretty small it's a medium they're all mediums guys but this one is this one is small so i'm not gonna talk too much gonna sleep on the back there and then it's like a little i don't know what this is high neck it's not a total neck it's not a real neck look it's got a little high neck and then it's got on the side it's got this roaching thing because this roaching trend is so much everywhere so this is what i was saying in my last one of my videos that that's a trend that i caught on to but mm, not everything guys but some so i don't mind because already i'm a covetous woman i don't have anything to prove to anybody i don't need to prove that listen i'm looking for cause because guys look at it it's already there look i'm not trying to prove anything i love the things that you see these days from jean or most of the you know brands they all have this rushing effect going on so it's a bit confusing if you really want to buy something that's on the dress down look so guys i'm going to wear this one and show you what it looks like so guys this is the next one a two-piece like i said i just feel like this is very tight for the medium compared to the black one i feel like this is way tighter now again it's an another one of those i'm running around going to grocery store type of um outfit the funny thing is when i was reading reviews and she in i heard people saying oh my god it makes me feel so classy so I'm starting to think that are we redefining the meaning of classy? I don't know. You could say like being dressed up, you could look elegant, but I don't know. Classy, elegant, I think they go together. The material though is something that I don't like. I don't see this material as a classy type of material. When we're talking about classy, you guys, I just as associate classy to do with things like silk, satin, some cotton, you know, linen, elegant. But this. I don't know what this is cotton lycra because it's you see that i don't know i don't think this is really elegant but we're gonna try as much as possible if they, they use the word sexy yeah okay sexy don't like the word but yes let's say it's sexy but i'm going to try to make it a bit elegant by throwing on a blazer so we see how it looks ladies so just adding a blazer has just upped the game for this outfit the blazer literally saved this outfit the blazer saved it now this is a blazer i got from the men's department in asos i think you must have seen a few of my videos i love this blazer a lot it's got like the satin lapels look at that so by adding a piece like this to this gray um outfit it's just up the game just go back low back pumps so guys you see the game has just gone up so we're no longer talking about we're just gonna run around in this outfit because the outfit has been elevated from well i don't know how much i bought it now from whatever it was to an elegant piece so that you can even go out in the evening to dine with this an evening out i think it all depends on how you wear your clothes to be honest if you wear your clothes trashy you're gonna look trashy if you wear your clothes with a touch of elegance then you're gonna look elegant and classy i guess 
that's what I can say you guys it's another two piece which is this one okay I did try this one last night I was trying a few of these things about an hour when they came yesterday because I was like yeah I'm not gonna just try them out the back here I'm gonna try them a little bit to see so this one is a it's a wide leg trouser in um like a lacquer kind of material uh it's got a very tiny top so it's like i'm sure it's supposed to be worn like a crop top so there you go this is the next piece i'm going to show you guys it's getting interesting isn't it <laughs> i feel so because this outfit is very interesting it puts all my beats that i really don't want to exhibit out there this one is the set here so this set you guys it looks nice on but what is this i'm seeing there <laughs> i'm not gonna lie like this this uh outfit it's not going anywhere like this is on the return pal it's on the return pal like i'm scared like when i walk you know guys when i walk i feel like it's gonna bunch there and then i'm going to be inconvenienced with the you know walking and doing this I, I ain't got time for that bullshit like i literally don't have time so if you are somebody who has uh you know the body who your thighs don't really meet you know if you're someone who's got slim outlook but you have some hips then go for this and also i feel like it's a bit on the transparent side so you might have to wear some kind of shorts underneath it if not um your panty everything is going to show so i'm going to turn to the back so you guys can see this is what the back looks like my bum is seriously massive out there so there you go this is one of the things i don't like about this because it's it's a flowy and free stuff but guys it kind of puts my whole bum you know i'm trying to limit the size of my bum and i feel like this is telling the whole world the size of my bum so guys look at this just look at this like oh honestly it's put my whole cup out there so yeah but i'm telling you now that this outfit is gorgeous it is actually nice it comes in different colors as well so yes ladies i'm not going to try to elevate this one because to be honest i'm not going to keep it but yes you can always style it with the back so yeah you can style it because it looks like a, it looks like a pretty nice set already so yeah i'm not going to try and wear a blazer with it next one you guys is what is here so this is like shin sexy i think this is shin sexy this is shin bay so yeah i think shin bay was the original well shin branch that first launched so this is shin bay it's in like a leopard leopard it says leopard print but guys it's ankle length so it's a nice piece it has the side whatever this is crunch or crunch i don't know but it's got it and it's you know like a little hot to neck thing i got mine in size 10 i think medium so it size me i don't know if medium is 10 or 8 i don't know but it's size medium so here this is my next piece i'm gonna take this off and then we're gonna throw this on and i'm gonna show you how this looks on so this one is the next one you guys i really like it uh look guys i love the shape so it is it was very tight for me to get in so i feel like if your head is bigger than my head you're really gonna struggle with this here to push your head through you know it was a nightmare to get through but overall it's beautiful so let me just show you guys you have to talk in my stomach you know we're trying to keep it snatched <laughs> we're doing a video so it has to be snatched okay so this is what the side looks like on that side and then this is what the other side looks like on this side now you guys this is what the back looks like it is from Shin Bay. and you know the good thing i love about this is look <laughs> i love the length the length the length you guys the length is what's doing it for me right now the length i love the length the lens ah oh, look at that and this is one of those things that 
and it's not right enough you know like when you're a woman you've got comps and you've got hips and all this stuff here going on and you have some sort of tricep even if it's below the knee as you walk it starts to rise up yes this one is taken care of it's got you know them things here them rashy rashy things here yeah, it's, it's got them you know so obviously it's cute you can wear it for dinner dinner guys dinner so yes and the summer so you can either like uh, it's a leopard print dress you can uh, just accessorize correctly like this throw on a blazer you guys a blazer would just kill this outfit okay so you really don't need much look at that they're good to go it looks so good and elegant so we're trying to turn our cheap items to inexpensive clothes yes you guys inexpensive clothes we're trying to turn them into elegant pieces look at that next ones you guys is this blouse here the top i got it in i think i got it in different colors you guys so i'm just gonna try i think two of them they're two different colors so you got this brown and you've got the mocha caramel mocha so it's up to you they're all browns which you want to go for i'm going to try them separately i got a skirt this one i like i don't like the rib though but i like the color and the feet in so i'm going to keep the skirt so guys i'm going to try this one and these together and these again and this so you got three pieces here so i'm going to take this off and try one of these so that you can see how it you know how it looks and also, like this is far here so i love the skirt the skirt has got some i don't know some roushing thing going on here so yeah and it's a ribbed material this skirt is ribbed this skirt is ribbed it's not like a plain material it's more of like a velvet kind of you know that sort of lines so just in case you're someone that don't, that does not like something that has lines is ribbed then you won't go for this but the shape and all is beautiful i'm gonna go back just to show you guys the length is ankle length i am five three and five four five three and a half five four that's my height and this hits me at the ankle but i feel like if you are even taller because if i drag this down now oh my god so i've just taken it down look so yeah so obviously i'm going to wear this i'm going to pull it up a bit make a little bit of some some here and then here we're good to go love the top this top i think it's just one i got one in the line that's another one that i got like five wonder why did i do that i don't even like the top like it's nice but it's not maybe it's the feet but this one i love here it's all covered you know love the way it fits Ugh, you're gonna accessorize accessorize correctly this bag has finally found a top that matches it look at the color look at that color of the top and the bag perfect yes you guys yes now can we just try to elevate this outfit like it is something we're gonna wear out in the evening or something when we're trying to elevate our outfit so what we do is guys i have decided to put my hair out not in the not in the back just to give it a different look so this is it just you know adding a nice blazer has lifted this outfit like oh my goodness a lot of people might not want to do so but if you want to lift your you know very casual outfit that you wear around to the grocery store if you want to have an edge like you want to lift it to something to become something more elegant guys this is the way to go and in a bag a pair of pumps and the rat blazer guys accessories that would work for you okay guys so this one gave me anxiety last night when i tried it on I mean, you're buying something and then you look at yourself in the mirror and you think, hell, hell no, no way am I going out like that. So this is one of it. I think like, if I had got a, like, a large a size large, it could have been better. Um, what really gave me anxiety was the skirt. So I'll show you. 
Yeah, it's one of those rushy rushy things. See the back is rushed. And then it has like a, a little skirt. I didn't know it has a little skirt in there. And um, trust me, <laughs> this skirt, my whole bum's taking the skirt. So basically I can't move anywhere with the skirt like this. I'm not trying to put myself out there. I'm not trying to prove anything to anybody to be honest. Like I buy this thing to myself because you know, anything I wear it makes me feel good. So yes, I slay them. But yeah, that's it. The top is the same, rushy rushy everywhere. This is the trend I was talking about. Like it's rushy, rushy everywhere. I don't even know what it which okay. This is the this is the this is supposedly the front and this is the back. So guys, a nice of top. I want to change into this one so that you can see exactly how this looks on me and how it gives me anxiety. This is what I was talking about. This is the outfit it gave me anxiety. The problem is I think it might be too tight because this is the size medium. I should probably have gotten a large. But when I was reading the reviews, everyone kept saying, ah, love the way it feels so snug. You have to get a snug one. But guys, it gives me anxiety knowing that this thing here, the inner little lightning is so short. If it was longer, I'd say fine, but it isn't. So I'm going to turn to the back so you can see what I'm saying. So you guys look at how short that inner lining thing is like it, i'm not a fan i'm not a fan of this russian thing to be honest i'm not a fan at all i, I feel i think it's weird maybe because i i, I got a bomb so that's why i see i feel like that is weird that this thing this thing going on here so i'm gonna go back so you guys can see look how transparent it is like on the bottom i feel naked even though i'm print guys can you see it is ankle like almost ankle leg though i have to say so maybe like i still wouldn't be able to wear it because guys i, I am very self-conscious person i feel like because of the way i'm shaped a lot of people would stare at me if i was to wear this even if i wasn't shaped this way i feel like if you was to wear this out people would still stare like people stare people look people stare at you you know so yeah i've seen a reviews people wore this out for weddings and stuff like that you know so yeah whatever uh, the only details is it's just the rushing effect like look at this a lot of rushing and here has like the split you know the sleeve here is split you guys so that's it i think i might decide i don't know yet but i might decide to get it in it because i love the color love this nude you know get off i love it a lot because it's part of my palette so yes you guys so yeah Guys, the next ones are these two here. They're very similar tops. I'm just going to show you. I'm sure I got a few colors. So it's got a zig. I don't know something going on in the front here, and I got it in a few color. And this, guess what, is regular sheen. So yeah, that's why they're so cheap regular sheen guys okay so this one i feel like i've gotten this one in size small i got them in size medium and it's got a little awkward thing going on here i'm going to change this outfit and wear um the cream colored skirt that i had on before so that you guys can see it is something that you want to get you know this is just probably coffee brown and this is kind of what caramel is this stuff here it's fire guys so yeah it is I'm not gonna lie it's fire it may be an ins inexpensive but this outfit is giving me life right now so i'm gonna turn to the side and to the other side i love the fact that this skirt is high waisted you know you can put it as high as you want to go and also remember this top you must get the right bra so i'm not wearing the right bra obviously so yeah i just have to push it to the side because if I decide to get the right bracket, we're going to be here forever, you know? So, this is it. Again, I think I'll wear this one for a night out. It's, I love the style. I love the style of the neck, you know? Yeah, yeah, I love the style of the neck. I like, I like it, you know? Sometimes it is good for expensive stuff to just rest and, you know, sometimes go with the flow. I can't complain. I love the top. So I'm gonna sweep swatch to the dark gray. You've got a, a dark brown one. You got a coffee one. I'm gonna sweep swap to that one, and you guys can see which one you prefer to get. Because remember, I'm wearing with a cream skirt, so I think with this brow, the the cream color is 
you know the best way to go with it okay you guys i thought the other one was fire this one is burning furnace you guys it's fire oh my god so now the materials are different completely that one is of a lighter uh, like a meshy type material just gonna make sure i know i'm saying it right i have no clue but this one this one it don't seem to be as transparent as the other one the other one was really transparent so yes ladies you will slay this all day all night like for dinners anything guys you want to wear this so remember these are my restrictions and stuff like that like just skirt like this even if you, if you have a a tulle skirt like a you know a fluid skirt you know the tulle skirt you can style it with this like it will be so fabulous oh my god it is yeah this is eye catching love the color color you guys i think it's yeah i think it's given yes guys i think the color is really given let me know what you think the last stuff in this haul guys is this one here i'm just going to show you what the front looks like i think this is a bit free so i feel like with this one i could have gotten a size small because i got a medium and it's kind of free here i think it's better it's a little bit you know you can see it's quite big so i'm not going to talk too much i'm just going to take this stuff off and throw this one on guys so you can see what i mean so ladies this is the next one and the last piece of clothing item in this haul i want to show you like let me just come closer so that you can see now i don't know i find it like it's a bit because i'm someone i'm not a big buster so i do wear bread that has a bit of you know help a bit of foam so i find it a bit awkward and weird like here and it's a little bit on the transparent side so i don't know i think a smaller size would have been ideal for me but if you are heavy busted this is going to be your friend but you must wear a bra that has support and then this is going to be your friend so i'm gonna quickly come closer again so that you guys can see and then the back yeah so this is the last one in this haul i think it's pretty simple i love the love the neutral direction that this is facing i really love it a lot i think like with an outfit like this anyone is good to go to be honest it's very it's very very chic yes you guys it's another chic outfit like yeah i'm not trying to dress it like up i feel like this is already the, it might be expensive but it's elegant i have to say like to be honest, I have to give credit to a lot of these pieces here that although they are inexpensive, a lot of them are elegant because one, they are not short. And I feel like for a dress, an item to get into that elegant category, you, you have to not be short. And these things are giving me ankle length, needing, you know, so kind of gives me and it gives you coverage, you know, it's, there's no really exposing here and there. So I feel like these ones have ticked the elegant mark for me. Initially, I thought like you do have to accessorize with a blazer to lift up the item. But guys, I feel like you don't even necessarily need a blazer. A blazer would definitely lift an outfit, but there's yeah, some things like this one, you guys. You don't necessarily need a blazer to lift you right now but i think this outfit is is gorgeous enough so yeah guys definitely it is have to give it to them you know people who haven't got money have to find a way to be able to dress as well like inexpensive things but to be able to wear things they like at the same time get some great some elegance into their life so i think this is one of those ways to go i super love it because not everyone can afford an an, an MOF, F, motf item you know not everybody can afford an item from motf like a silk dress they're like over 100 pounds 70 something to over 100 pounds not everybody can do that so 
if you can wear these and feel elegant and look elegant, guys, why not? Go for it. This brings us to the last item. Unfortunately, guys, this item is a tad uncomfortable for me to walk in. And to make matters worse, it's not for wide feet, you know? I, I have wide feet, so when I tried it, because I tried it already, guys it wasn't the eat so i'm not gonna even show you guys like i tried it before i'm just gonna bring it closer so that you guys can see it's quite comfortable to walk with i'm still gonna link it there if you're one of those people who don't mind you know uh, pain who don't mind pain you know over comfort so there you go i wish it was it was for wide feet and it was not as high as this then i would take this one because ones i got from Shein about two years ago they're still good you know i love them so much i've worn them everywhere I took them on holiday guys you can even see like <laughs> this one has no rashes look at this one here you see what i mean so i'm not joking this one was a bit disappointing i really wanted a clear sandals i'm gonna try again and see what are the clear heels that was for white is for white feet and not as high as this i'm gonna try again so guys, this is my last item in this haul. So guys, we've come to the end of this video and you know what time it is. It is our daily refresh time with God. So I'm going to read from Psalm 143 verse 10 and I'm reading from the NLT version. And it says, teach me to do your will for you are my God. May your gracious spirit lead me forward on a firm footing. You do know that um as human beings guys we do not know the will of god but you can pray you can ask god to teach you to know his will because a lot of times we might be praying for something but that is not the will of god for us like so like you might be praying for something but you're hitting your head against there and god wants you to go that way so the will of god is that way so guys all the saying is you know pray to god for god to teach you let it let it resonate with your spirit the will of god so that your soul does not lead you on a firm footing instead the spirit the spirit of god may lead you uh, forward on a firm footing that is it you guys so we've come to the end of the video let me know in the comment section what you thought about this haul there's gonna be another one coming because guys i got all the stuff and all the stuff yeah so keep the notification bell on and guys don't forget to subscribe like and share guys i want to say thank you i love you guys so much and it's bye from me your fabulous host ellery guys bye